I'm Major K. Kendall Matthews, and I'm inviting you to take just a few moments of your time to learn more about the amazing work we're doing right here in St. Louis, where we're rebuilding families, recycling goods, and rehabilitating lives. Our primary focus here at the Rehabilitation Center is to offer soup, soap, and salvation. That's soup for the stomach, soap for the body, and salvation for the soul. The acronym of the ARC stands for Adult Rehabilitation Center. But in our situation and under our leadership, we focus in on assessing and restoring and Christ, assessing the damage that's been done to their lives, restoring this man back to a healthy lifestyle, and Christ, most importantly, introducing them or reintroducing them to a stronger relationship with our Maker, Lord, and Savior, Jesus Christ. Our program is work therapy. It's important that men get back into society. We have counseling, we have life skills, we have Bible study, just a plethora of services to help men take their life back and to give them a fighting chance uh, in society. There's spiritual restoration, and there's community service. So we take those three areas of the work of the Salvation Army and the ultimate goal is to get them back started, get them reacquainted with themselves and with and in the workforce. We are saving souls. We are serving suffering humanity. And we're reaching out to people who need hope for tomorrow with Christ in the center of all that we do. That's the difference between the Salvation Army and other nonprofit organizations. We're focused in on saving souls and giving them a new start, not just a word, but an actual change of heart, change of life, style, in the name of Jesus Christ. We see fathers, we help sons, uncles, grandfathers. These men are a part of our community. They're part of the fabric of who we are in this community. And so that's how we know we're making a difference because we're helping John and his son or we're helping Rudolph and his nephew. We're helping men to take their lives back right here in St. Louis. 82 cents out of every dollar goes towards direct services. That's a blessing. So if a person gave us $1, 82 cents out of that dollar goes towards food, shelter, and clothing. It goes towards restoring men. It goes towards our program here at the Salvation Army. That's a very large percentage, but that percentage is impacted and influences our program. And the community needs to know that we're not wasting money, but we're being the best stewards of the dollars that people trust us with or the product that people entrust us with right here at the ARC. We are totally self-sufficient. We're dependent upon the donations of our stockholders, the local business, that perhaps have gone out of business. We're there to pick up that product and use that product and resell that product. You know, one person told me on one occasion, they said, the Salvation Army thrift store is my Kmart, is my Target, it's my Sears. So our people who shop at our thrift stores are stockholders in our programs. They help us to do our program and they help us to do the most good for this community. An administrator is a servant leader. I'm a leader of leaders. Our goal uh, is to not just administer, but to do it in the name of Jesus Christ. You see, Jesus had his 12 disciples as he ministered and, and walked this earth. We have several disciples who are part of our support team and our support staff. And we lead them with the love of the Lord, with the passion of the priests, 
and with the love of Jesus Christ. I hope that what you've just seen, what you've just experienced, has had a positive impact on your life. The Salvation Army Adult Rehabilitation Center, doing the most good in our neighborhood, in our city, and in our county. Thank you, and may God bless you.